Welcome back. It's 746. Good morning, everyone. It's a mild and muggy start to our morning. Lots of clouds to begin our day, but the clouds will eventually give away to sunshine. So I am expecting a mostly sunny day. 67 degrees. It is muggy out there. If you haven't stepped out already, we have those winds out of the southeast at eight miles per hour in New Orleans. So again, even though we are starting off with lots of clouds right now, it's going to be a really nice day. So if you are heading out to any parades, you should be fine. So here's a look at our current temperatures here across the area. Good morning, Slidell. 64, 61 in Bogalusa, upper 60s in Bell Chase, as well as Reserve and Kenner. And we're in the mid 60s in Thibodeau and Homa. And temperatures will quickly warm up through the morning, heading into the afternoon hours. And a quick check of your winds, really not that bad, but anytime we get an onshore flow, that's going to continue to. Uh, pump up the moisture in the area and our dew points in the mid 60s, upper 50s in a few locations. Anytime we see our dew point temperatures in the mid to upper 60s, lower 70s, it feels humid out there and we're going to keep the humidity around not only today, tomorrow and into our Monday. So here's your planning forecast by 11 middle to upper 70s. We should be in the lower 80s closer to 2, 3 o'clock this afternoon under mostly sunny conditions. A mostly dry day, but a few pop-up showers can't be ruled out. This evening looks fantastic. Still warm in the upper 70s by 5, and we're looking at lower 70s closer to 7 o'clock. And your local expert forecast, 79 in Homa, 80 in Thibodeau, and we're looking at lower 80s in Hammond, Laplace, and Picayune. So the chances for rain today, mostly dry. I really think a few pop-up showers, but overall mostly dry day. Things change as we head into tomorrow, and I am expecting a cold front to roll through the area as we head into our Monday, and that is going to increase our chances for showers and also a few storms. So dry for the month of March, even though Mar March just began, but even for the year, picked up a little over five inches of rainfall, so our deficit here, we are below, below normal, so we need the rain across the area. So taking you through the rest of the day, showers really off to the west, a few pop-up showers are possible, but mostly sunny conditions as we head into tonight, partly cloudy skies and tomorrow morning starting off with a mix of sunshine and clouds, but a few showers are possible. Just keep that umbrella with you just in case and we can see a few lingering showers as we head into our Sunday night. Now Monday cold front will move into the area, but ahead of that cold front Monday morning, scattered showers are possible, but notice how scattered they are really hit or miss when that cold front slides through as we head into the afternoon hours. We may see a few thunderstorms develop along that front and a few of those storms could potentially be strong. We'll watch out for that, but again, we are looking at a wet start to our work week and the weather pattern will really remain unsettled through most of the work week. So keep that in mind. And then as we head into our Monday night, we may see a few lingering showers. So here's your seven day forecast today mostly dry lots of sunshine humid and warm as we head into tomorrow temperatures in the lower 80s I put a 40% coverage for showers cold front moves through on Monday still remaining warm but notice the temperature difference turning cooler in the upper 60s mid 60s on Wednesday but again we'll be back in the 70s as we head into our Thursday